Cameron Fontana, though, got a chance to talk with a travel expert who fills us in on the places people are planning to visit for just that, a little relaxation. Thanks, Sean. You know, after the holidays, it always seems like a great time to take a vacation. But like myself, I always seem to have a hard time deciding on where to go. So travel expert Kendra Thornton is joining us to tell us where people are heading to get more boom for their buck. Good morning, Kendra. Good morning. So there was a recent survey talking about where people are going to be going in 2015. What were some of those results? Well, the survey was conducted by Choice Hotels, and they have about 6,300 properties globally, and they really want to get a sense for the travel trends of 2015. And the big news is that Americans plan to travel and spend more on their travel in the wow. new year, about 8% more. As far as where they want to go, the number one pick by those surveyed was the Western National Parks. So whether it is Yellowstone National Park or Yosemite or the Grand Canyon, these are places that Americans are most interested in visiting in the new year, which I think is an outstanding choice. Wow. Um, as far as events that people want to travel to uh, next year, the Mardi Gras was the number one pick, of course, in New Orleans, which sounds like a lot of fun. And that was followed closely by the Cherry Blossom Festival in Washington, D.C. And then uh, another top pick was the Super Bowl, of course, because we Americans love our football. <laughs> right. Now, when we're going on our vacations, of course, we have to find a place to stay. And with that includes amenities. So what amenities are most people shopping for at their hotel? Well, it's important to note that the survey found about 40% of Americans opt to stay at mid-priced hotels when they travel. On average, they'll spend about $116 per night. So even though we are budget conscious as a nation, we are still willing and want to splurge on travel if we're going to have some unique experience or something authentic is going to happen when we do. And that is why the, hotel, the Ascend Hotel Collection is rapidly expanding to really cater to travelers who want these unique experiences. And I have to say, a perfect example is where I am here today. Oh. I'm at the plantation on Crystal River, and I'm in the northwest part of Florida. It's a hidden gem in Florida's nature coast. It's really beautiful here, but what's so spectacular is it's the only place in the world where you can learn about and swim with the endangered West Indian manatee. So they're migrating now. Um, it's a really awesome experience. So I think Americans are happy to spend for travel when they can do like a bucket list type opportunity like this. Well, Kendra, you sold me on Florida. So now that I know I want to go there <laughs> and I want to find some hotels during the holidays, what are the best bargain days to shop for that deal? Well, there's really no bargains when it comes to the holidays. The best piece of advice I always give to people is to try to travel outside of the most popular dates uh, this holiday season. That will be between December 26th and January 4th. So if you have flexibility to be outside of those dates, you're of course going to get better rates and availability. But another piece of advice too is to look for hotels that are going to give you more uh, for your money. Uh, the comfort brands are a perfect example because they include free Wi-Fi, free hot breakfast, free parking and these are things that a lot of hotels do charge for so look for places where you can stay and you're gonna get you know more bang for your buck and be able to stretch your travel dollars further finally Kendra where can our viewers get more information on the survey people can go to choicehotels.com to learn more thank you so much for joining us again go take a dip take a dip in that pool I'm gonna be joining you probably in a month is that okay <laughs> <laughs> perfect I'll see you then thank you thank you Kendra more to come on Good Day Marketplace. Stay tuned.